Kentucky closer to our city. The Lloydminster Rohan Rage enter the North Sutter Cup in good spirits after ending the season winning five of their last six. Their target now to earn a berth at Provincials. Back on the ice. The guys have bought in and, and they're working hard and they want to come into this weekend and try and make a statement. I feel like we're peaking at the right time right now. Feels good that we beat the two top teams last weekend, so I'm feeling pretty confident. As they should, the Rage have registered wins in five of their last six games, courtesy of strong play from Brett Swifel and Aaron Dennis. I think we just found their right line combo at the right time at the uh, perfect time in the season. Really got us three working together, putting up points, which is really helping out the team. Everything seems to go in right now. It feels good, so we're starting to win, and it's good to go in a tournament like that. We've had Brett and, and Aaron together here for probably a month, and we've had a couple different wingers, but uh, they've really started using one another, and, you know, they, uh, they're working great together. But head coach Mike Armstrong is quick to point out that this is a team that does things by committee. The stars of the team is the team, so and that's, that's what uh, our concept is. Each guy has a role on this team. They understand their role. Sometimes they're not always happy with it, but they understand their role. The Rage are in Pool A with SSAC, Leduc, and Fort Sask. The recent success against these teams is a boost for the Rage, but they're cautious knowing that they left a bitter taste in their opponents' mouths. They're still going to be ready to bounce back right at us, and they're going to want the W, but we're going to want it more, and we're going to have to do whatever we need to do. It's a tough competition for sure, so I think we're excited for it, and we're up for the challenge right now, so... It's great. Whether it's gold, silver, bronze, we know that one of those three medals will get us into provincials in Red Deer in, um, in later on in March, and uh, that's where we want to be. All right, the Lord Mr. Bobcats, fresh up hosting Scotiabank Hockey Day in Canada, have their sights set on bringing another national event to the border city. The Cats, in partnership with the Lloydminster Economic Development Corporation, the AJHL, Hockey Alberta, and the local RBC branch have submitted a bid to host the 2016 RBC National Junior A Championship. The event is a five-team tournament which includes three regional junior hockey league champs, the West runner-up, and the host team. Lloydminster has had great success hosting large-scale events like Scotiabank Hockey Day in Canada and the Allen Cup. Torch Relay came through here for the Vancouver Olympics and you look at the Hartnell MacArthur Holpe uh, Celebrity Golf Classic every year, that's raised $600,000. So it's pretty clear that this town loves hockey and it loves its sports and, and we said why not a 2016 RBC Cup, we're ready. The bid was submitted on January 17th, the day before Hockey Day in Canada, and officials are hoping the huge success of that event will help win the bid. Hosting the RBC Cup would put the Bobcats on the national spotlight. Huge for our team, you know, from a recruiting standpoint for the next two seasons, we can really build on this event, and it'll be something that uh, we think will will leave a legacy for years to come here in Lloydminster. For our league as well, they have... Uh have a potential host for that event and um, you know it's the the crown jewel of, of junior a hockey across the country and I was fortunate enough obviously last year to to go to that event in Summerside and you know it's really a highlight for for the country. The decision will be made by Hockey Canada over the next few months with an official announcement coming in May. That's your first look at sports. Gerard is up next with weather.